a special hello to you special people who are watching us and following us with Iran Travel Guide. This time we are in one of the most interesting and impressive villages in Iran. It's called Mosule. A millennium old Mosule is situated near the capital of Mazandaran, which is called Rasht. Very close to Rasht, uh, it's about probably uh, 30 minutes away, you can find a wonderful village, as I said, called Masule. Masule is a very old uh, village which has been registered in the book of the heritage of the world. And uh, I would like to tell you that in Masule, you can see wonderful and historical buildings. You know, the roof of one house is exactly the pathway and the uh, pathway of another house. You know, it's just steps on steps. And this village is situated in a forested area of the mountain, which sometimes is full of mist and fog. Yes, fog and mist draped the village. And also the buildings are so impressive and attractive. Right now we're going to explore this village. Be with us and follow us with Mosle. If you are one of those people who love old structures and building, especially the rusticity of any small villages, then Masule is the place for you to explore. You know, today we have come to Masule and we're going to explore the little alleys which winds through the village and beautiful houses, especially some geraniums which are out of the windows, you know, small windows, the windows are open, and the geraniums, different color geraniums, are, are just visible everywhere you go. So not only the flower is beautiful, but also the city, I mean, the, the village and the rusticity of this village will be eye-catching and breathtaking. So be with us and follow us in today's program. If you love tempting snacks, well, this is a place for you. Dry plums and probably some apricots, which are so tasty and wonderful. You can just sip a little, but before that, don't forget, you have to get the permission. Probably you have to pay too, of course. But it is so tempting that when you come here in Masule, you do need to take some of them and taste them. Let's go, there are a lot to see and a lot to explore. So let's go and follow us.
Well, this is another thing that easily you can see in this village. Handmade socks, hats, and even small dolls. You know, the handmade stuff here is, is exactly made by the hands of mostly old women. It is so interesting. Not only the dolls, the socks, the hats, everything you can see. Probably we can find some wooden cars or some kind of work which is made on the wood. Let's go and see what we can find. Well, you get a, a very interesting feeling when you see people are passing by, you know, from different walks of life, especially little children who are full of energy. They're going up and down from this village. It's so interesting, especially the handmade. Let's go and see what they have here. Hmm. This is a woolen socks, I guess. It's a woolen socks made by the hand of some, probably little girls or some old women. So wonderful. Half the man, well, almost two or three dollars. You know what that's up to the Hamena? Yes, the, the grandmother is usually expert in making and weaving these socks. Well, they're going to learn, you know, the young ones also. Since there are lots of tourists here, some of the old uh, women here who sell something, they are really tired of talking to the you know, tourists, but uh, they are so warm-hearted and so hospitable, just like everyone in Iran. So don't forget, if you have any question, you can ask them, talk to them. They, will, they don't mind it at all, you know, they will give you the answer right away.